Hindustan Aeronautics Limited has unveiled the design of HLFT-42, a next generation supersonic training aircraft, which is the talk of the town soon after the unveiling. Well, the reason is the particular print of Hindu god Maruti, which is a part of its tail art. Well, this supersonic trainer aircraft is said to be the game changer and will be used and is capable of a number of things. And to talk about the functions, I have group captain H.V. Thakur to talk about it. Sir, uh, welcome to CNN News 18. I want to ask about the features of this particular aircraft because they say that this is going to be the game changer. No, it's definitely going to be the change, game changer because uh, it's a trainer which is a new generation, generation trainer. Uh, it's uh, designed exactly to fit the area where training is not being done. That is for fifth generation aircraft. The training for fifth generation aircraft and four and a half generation aircraft. Also. So all of these aircraft are going to be developed and along with them this trainer is going to be developed because they are all single crew aircraft. Uh, in Indian conditions, uh, we like uh, field uh, pilots to get field experience on actual aircraft. Unlike uh, in some countries abroad where they like directly from simulator to go into a fighter aircraft, uh, stealth fighter aircraft. Here we prefer that we have a trainer. So this trainer is going to give training for fifth generation aircraft of the future. So this is the trainer of the 2030s. And uh, perhaps uh, many countries uh, will uh, kind of uh, realize uh, the gap that they have and join along with us uh, with so this idea. People, people are quite excited about its design because you have used a Hindu god Maruti on uh, on tail. What is the idea behind it? Uh, uh, yeah, this is a question which keeps coming back to me. So uh, there was a great inspirational project which uh, HAL had done which is called HF24 Marut. Uh, <coughs> Marut. Uh, being uh, meaning the spirits of the wind or wind itself and uh, Pavan Putra which is this is the natural descendant of the Marut because uh, it has some similarities in configuration uh, I, I know it doesn't look similar it's a highly modernized and uh, this generation trainer but definitely from design point of view there are some uh, uh, we're carrying some legacy from uh, our old uh, learnings so um, the uh, Pavan Putra sticker at the tail of the aircraft is a great inspiration for our designers, for pilots, for everyone. That's why it is there. Other than that, sir, if you can the advanced features, if you can just count one or two for us. So it has the uh, IRST, AISA radar, its uh, SPJ is also AISA based, it's got uh, uh, MOS. Uh, obviously it can carry a big payload of missiles, etc. which uh, in uh, secondary roles when uh, you know training is no more there and you need to go into operations it will require so uh, and it can carry a EOTS or a LDP etc oh, um, the cockpit is a glass cockpit it's got a large uh, large area display side stick uh, uh, head up display which is quite modern so definitely uh, state of the art avionics and sensors how hopeful you are as far as the order is concerned do you think that it will be able to you know uh, excite the uh, decision makers or decision takers? It will definitely excite, not only in India, but internationally it will excite everyone. Uh, the orders will come later, first we have to develop it fully and uh, uh, make it risk free and then the uh, op field operators come on board, come on board, test it out and uh, we'll be happy to sh show it to the world. Alright, so uh, definitely uh, the design is uh, the talk of the town and uh, HAL has basically unveiled this uh, trainer aircraft that has the image of Maruti on its tail and also the tagline is the storm is coming which add on to its impact while it is about the speed and the features of the aircraft. Definitely HAL has unveiled this particular aircraft in Aero India, 14th edition of Aero India and they are quite hopeful for the orders as well.